Do you know what's fascinating about football? Some players spend ages at a club and it barely raises an eyebrow. But then some swoop in like a hurricane, stay for just a few months and leave an everlasting impact. No beating around the bush here, straight to the point. These are the players who truly shine. Today, we're diving into 10 extraordinary players who have brief, yet incredibly memorable, stints at some of the biggest clubs in the world. Starting from the most recent, Kim Min Jai has been dubbed as the monster, and whoever has given him the name has done justice. With only one season at Napoli, he has done what many could not do. First Serie A win since 1990. Against Atalanta, he was perfect and played the best game of his Italian career. Every intervention and tackle made by the defender was underlined by the choirs and applause of the Maradona Stadium. He ran and fought like a gladiator of ancient Rome and was never afraid of physical confrontation. It was on that night that Danish striker Rasmus Hoyland experienced the worst nightmare of his career, thanks to the relentless prowess of the 26-year-old. Perhaps we'd not be able to see more of him in a Napoli shirt, as he's set to move to Bayern. Another player who made a big impact during a short period was Aubameyang at Barcelona. This Gabonese forward had an unforgettable six-month stint in Catalonia, where he left a lasting impression by scoring an impressive tally of 13 goals and providing one assist. Not only did he contribute to Barcelona's resurgence, but he also played a pivotal role in reigniting the intense La Liga title race with Real Madrid. In fact, Barcelona delivered a 4-0 victory over their arch-rivals on their own turf, thanks to Aubameyang's incredible performances. Now, let's talk about how the tales of football can be both cruel and forgiving. Loris Karius is the name etched into the minds of many football fans, but often for the wrong reasons. Yes, we vividly recall his unfortunate blunders in the Champions League final. However, it's time to shed light on a forgotten truth, a truth that very few remember. In the 2017-18 season, he had a fantastic run. He kept a clean sheet in 29 out of 34 appearances. And it was his outstanding performances that helped Liverpool reach the Champions League final for the first time since 2007. So if we take that one bad day away from his life, we could argue that his 2017-18 season at Liverpool was memorable. Elsewhere, when it comes to Ronaldinho, there's a lot to discuss. From his mesmerising moves to his cute smiles. Among his various club experiences, one that stands out as the most impactful is his time at PSG. Although his spell in Paris during the 2002-03 season didn't bring much silverware, Ronaldinho's first season in Europe left a lasting impression. His incredible form caught the attention of big clubs as he showcased his skills with 12 goals and 10 assists across all competitions. It was during his time at PSG that Ronaldinho's star began to rise, showcasing the immense potential that would lead him to achieve greatness in the years to come. Speaking of memorable spells, Ronaldinho's former buddy and Selecao partner, Ronaldo Luiz, had a brief but powerful stint at Barcelona. In the 96-97 season, this Brazilian forward made an unforgettable impact. He scored a remarkable 47 goals and helped Barcelona clinch both the Copa del Rey and the UEFA Winners' Cup. Despite the short stay, his performances left a deep mark on the history of the club, and his achievements are still celebrated by fans today, just like how PSG fans remember Bex for his short legacy. See, the French fans surely remember him for more than just his fancy hair gels and stylish flair. Beckham made his grand entrance into the Parisian scene during the winter of 2012-13, right when his career was reaching its twilight. But boy, did Beckham make an impact. He played a crucial role in helping PSG secure the coveted Liga 1 title, which marked the beginning of their domination under the watchful eye of Nasser Al Khalifi. It was a game-changer for the club, and Beckham's presence on the field brought a touch of magic to their game. Similarly, another player who falls in the same category is Ashley Young. Among his numerous adventures, his time at Inter Milan was truly intriguing. The versatile English wing-back embarked on a memorable journey with the Nerazzurri during the 2020-2021 season. 
Young played a pivotal role in helping Inter Milan clinch the Serie A title in 2021 and even reach the final of the Europa League in 2020. It was quite the turnaround for him, considering the memes and jokes that had circulated during his later days at Manchester United. Shifting our focus from Ashley Young's impactful stint at Inter Milan, let's now turn our attention to another player who left his mark in a different era. Laurent Blanc's influential time at Barcelona. From 1996 to 1997, Blanc showcased his skills as a central defender, bringing stability and leadership to Barcelona's defence. He played a vital role in their campaign, featuring in 51 matches across different competitions. Blanc's contributions can be seen in the numbers. During the 1996-97 season, he helped Barcelona win the Copa del Rey and reach the final of the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup. His solid performances at the back were key to the team's success. But it wasn't just about statistics. Blanc's presence on the field brought a sense of composure and organisation to the team's defensive line. His ability to read the game and make crucial interceptions or tackles was instrumental in keeping the opposition at bay. While his time in Barcelona may have been short, the impact he made cannot be overlooked. Blanc's contributions laid the groundwork for future successes at the club and his legacy as a respected figure in Barcelona's history endures. Another Frenchman who made a significant impact during his short tenure was none other than Patrick Vieira. He found himself at the twilight of his journey when he joined Manchester City for the 2010-2011 season. But Vieira's presence at Manchester City extended beyond his contributions on the field. As a seasoned professional, he mentored and guided emerging stars like Sergio Aguero, David Silva, Yaya Toure, Vincent Kompany and Joe Hart, playing a pivotal role in their development as they flourished into key players for the club. Lastly, Jurgen Klinsmann, the current South Korea manager, had a remarkable stint at Tottenham Hotspur. Arriving in the 94-95 season, he made a significant impact that went beyond trophies. With his emphatic performances on the pitch and a positive attitude towards fans and the media, Klinsmann successfully transformed the English bitterness towards Germany. He managed to win over the hearts of Tottenham supporters, becoming a fan favourite despite previous animosity. In a nutshell, these 10 players may have been here for a quickie, but boy oh boy did they rock the big clubs. Remember, it's not always about how long you stay, but the moves you make that count. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, turn on the bell notification so that you never miss out on new content. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye.